What a beautiful place you've got here on a marvellous autumn, autumn day. I mean, this is a tremendous place for anybody to study. And I think it's wonderful you've got a course like this where you can actually practice hands-on journalism like this and you can do things, try things out. And uh, you don't have to learn on the job anymore. You can learn in the classroom and then you can, having perfected things, work things out, you can then go and operate in the real world. So what, what a tremendous thing you've got going here. It's, it's a real replica, if you like, of what goes on in the industry. And it's really important that people have the same kind of kit that they're going to see when they, when they go and work and they find a job. And it's really important they're familiar with that kit and they can, from day one, they've got a sense of what's going on. The details will be different, but the fundamentals are all there. So you've got all the things you need. You've got the, the gallery, you've got the, the studio, you've got the lighting, you've got the sound desk, you've got the vision desks. And uh, you've got the, and then you can make the content, you know. So you can, you really can make a little scale model of what goes on in the industry. Uh, at large and, and that's what you need, you need that training ground. I think today you've seen a, a couple of students uh, efforts at doing some te television journalism, their early efforts, uh, and, and you were able to go through the students with them ab about that work. Uh, what did you think of that? I, I, was, I was really impressed because these were really very early efforts indeed and they were, they'd edited the, edited the stories themselves, they'd found the stories and there were some really interesting things going on there and with only a little bit of development and a little bit of extra push you could really polish these things up so I'd be interested to come back in a few months time and see some real real improvements. You're really looking for yes you're looking for some technical skills these days clearly but most of all you're looking for that mental attitude and you're looking for real knowledge about the world and public affairs so you can be of use to editors um, you know as soon as possible really so you're looking for a real breadth and interest in the world and explaining it and that's something you really develop by reading widely as possible watching as much output as you can listening to the radio reading the newspapers and really immersing yourself I mean becoming a news junkie frankly and if you're going to be a journalist, you've got to you've got to get you've got to become part of that and start thinking that way. Well, I just think that this is a, a course like this, an environment like this, is a real opportunity for people to see how to work as a real journalist, to develop that sense of curiosity, and to learn how to carry it through in the real world, and to actually to recognise the kind of things that make stories, the kind of things that separate journalists from ordinary people. So they're thinking like journalists are expected to think. And so they're in a really good position to get, to get jobs.